guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to go into Hobby Lobby to see what we can find. It is just a rainy, nasty day outside. Tired of the rain, guys, but spring is coming. I've seen daffodils blooming all around my house. And so, anyway, we're gonna take advantage of that. And um, I think we're gonna prepare for spring, okay? I'm tired of seeing snowmen in the house. Like, winter's done, right? <laughs> It's almost March, and uh, oh, I'm just looking forward to flowers and spring days, green grass, warm sunshine. I'm dreaming, okay? It's really yucky outside today. <laughs> anyway, so come along with me. We're going to head into Hobby Lobby, and then um, hopefully wrap this video up with decorating the house. It may be the next day, but um, yeah, so let's go. Before we head into the store though, I did want to show you um, just one way that I stay focused when I'm in Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby is an awesome store. There's a lot of things in there and it's exciting and it's easy to get off track and like forget what you're in there for. And so what I do is I take pictures of the spaces in my house that I want to decorate and that gives me like a focal... Um, I guess focus you know a point to focus my mind on so that I don't get um, all overwhelmed in there so I'm gonna show you what I mean okay so this is one of my entryways and I want to redecorate this little table and so you know it kind of gives me that idea of how long it's gonna be you know how much space I'm dealing with there's my other entryway table I want to decorate <clears throat> possibly something with the bookshelf although it's kind of cute the way it is right now maybe something there um, the wood stove area, uh, this chair, that's no man pillow, Oop, focus, has got to go. <laughs> and um, the quilt rack, I'd like to look at that, and then of course the piano. So those are some of the areas that I want to decorate. And now I can go into the store and have a clear purpose in mind. Let's go. Oh, they're so adorable. Oh my goodness, how cute. <laughs> Isn't this absolutely adorable? I thought, well, this could look really cute in the entryway. Ugh, how cute. And then there's all this beautiful garland down here. Love that. That could go above the TV console area. Super pretty, guys. And this is another really super cute option here. It says welcome, and it has the lavender sprigs. Hmm, that's a hard one. <laughs> You guys, I really wasn't thinking bunnies and like Easter, but how cute are these bunnies? Oh my goodness. Look. Like super duper cute. Oh man. This doesn't make you think spring. I don't know what will. Look at all the color. And beautiful. So pretty. Alright guys, well I did Hobby Lobby and then since Ross was like right there, how could I not go in Ross? Y'all know that's my favorite. So I ran in Ross and I hit the jackpot with artificial greenery and I absolutely I'm so excited about it. So I did not um, I didn't actually film in the in the store in Ross so oh well. It's okay I'll show you all the haul later either tonight or tomorrow when, before I decorate. So I can't wait to show you guys what I got. All right, headed home in the rain. It's almost six o'clock, so I gotta get home and make some supper. <laughs> 
Hey guys, so it's the next day. I've hauled everything in from the car. I've got it all sitting here on my kitchen table, so I'll have to show you that in just a minute. I'm so excited. I've cleared away like all the snowmen, all that wintry stuff, because I'm ready for spring, remember? <laughs> so, and there's sunshine outside, at least some today, so that's helping. Anyway, so I've cleared away all the wintry stuff, and I've also wiped down all the surfaces with an e-cloth so that they're now dust free and we've got a nice empty slate to work with. So I'm so excited. Let's hop right into this. Okay, so let's see what we got first. All right, so I did go in Hobby Lobby, but then I went in Ross because it was right next door and I scored all these awesome artificial plants. Look at this. I'm thinking maybe like on top of the piano or something. Isn't this awesome? All right, so I've got that. And then I found this one as well. Isn't this like a snake plant or something like that? Anyway, awesome. It looks like it's in this little basket. And then, oh, I've gotta show you guys up close. Okay. So basically, it looks like it has rocks in there, and I've tried a bunch of different lighting, and I can't get it to show. But anyway, it looks like it has little pebbles, and it's in this cute little basket. So I'm super excited about where we're going to put this. Okay, another item I found at Ross. Another little grassy greenery here. It has little pebbles inside. A pretty little white ceramic pot. Super duper excited about, um, yeah, I'm super excited about these. You know what's so great about these? Is I don't have to water them. <laughs> I don't have to forget and they're not gonna shed. Look at this adorable bonsai. Look at that. Oh, I love it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so there's that one and Oh, I got some socks. <laughs> they're Adidas and they're just um, black socks, so that'll be handy. All right, we'll pop those over there. Um, anything else from Ross? I'm gonna say that was it. Oh no, 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 no. I got this lamp because I need a new lamp to put on the piano. Because the lamp we have is like this. Um, woodsy lamp and it's just not you know I, I don't know we're not north woods here we're kind of westerny so anyway I found this one this lamp all right so now let's get into the Hobby Lobby part all right so we've got all this awesome greenery to work with from Ross <clears throat> super duper exciting and let's see what we got from Hobby Lobby because some pretty cool things there too now everything was at least 40% off at Hobby Lobby. Um, all their spring things. And pictures as well. So, one I got was this really cute sign. It says, hello. Hello. So I'm just, I'm, I don't know. I've got a couple places in mind for it. You know, I took the pictures, I showed you that earlier, how I take pictures of the spaces that I want to decorate. Um, but this time I just found several pieces that could go several different places, so we'll see. All right, so we got that sign. And let's see what else. All right, so I have ideas for some of this stuff to kind of go in a similar area, kind of in the entryway is what I'm thinking. So this little guy, home, and it's got this a cute little wreath that goes around it and the, um, the black and white plaid stuff going on. So, do everything uh, for the glory of God, and yeah. And then I got this little rabbit here. Look at that little guy, isn't he cute? Cute little rabbit, white, kind of whitewashed. So that'll go sort of together. And then this little count your blessings, it says. So a little sprig of greenery on there. I grabbed these. I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with them, but I love the color scheme. So just some springtime eggs. And I got 
some stickers too. Don't tell the kids. Shh. Aren't they adorable? Look at that. Little flowers and cute little bunnies. And more bunnies. And we won't tell them. I'll stick them over there with my socks. <laughs> All right. Let's see what else. And I also have some other stuff to work with, so it's not just this stuff, but okay. Look at this one, cute as can be. It's that black and white plaid little bunny. So he's gonna go kind of together with some of this stuff. And I just love how the black and white buffalo plaid or plaid or however you wanna call it, looks at the greenery. It is so pretty. All right, and then if I would've known all the little scores I would've found in Ross for artificial plants, I probably wouldn't have spent five bucks on this because that was just overpriced compared to Ross. But isn't it cute? <laughs> it's in just a little clay looking pot. So, not that. <clears throat> All right, last bag here. I'm excited about this cotton. Now I saw some of this done in Hobby Lobby. It was like ready to go in a jar and everything. And I'm like, I have old jars like that. So the cotton was in the jar and it just looked really pretty. And I thought, well that would go that would go great, okay? Because obviously I'm going with very earthy whites and um, greens and that sort of thing. All right, the last thing I got was this to hang. Isn't that so cute? So I think just, oh, I can't wait to get this up. So. All right, so let's hop into decorating. Some things I have that I've had for years, like this little birdhouse that my mom gave me. Isn't it cute? It's getting older, like the moss is turning yellow instead of green, but it's still cute. So you've got that. I've got several jars to work with. Uh, I do have this little basket of pink flowers, little tulips and stuff. We may use that. And um, yeah, so let's get started. So I'm working on clearing off the piano here so we can decorate it and uh, anyway, this is um, the lamp. Woo! This is the lamp that's going to be replaced. See, it's got a moose on it, which is great if you live in Maine or Alaska, but yeah, it, it's just not working and we've had it for many years and so I finally replaced it. I'm just hoping it fits in the space. I had to move the piano out from the wall in order to get to the plug. the new lamp guys oh it's looking good okay all right I do like this stack of, of handles here just because well partly because it's just so much easier when we want to sing from them you just pull them down and play so I'll probably leave those there but the rest of it is an empty slate okay what do you think? So, I mean, technically, just this little, you know, plants and lamp look great. Originally, I had thought about putting a bunch of green plants on there, so let's see what that looks like, okay?
know, I feel like it, it needs something different. I'm not really sure what though. I do like how this bonsai plant looks with the lamp though. I think that it like, I don't know, it just looks really good with it. But I'm not so sure how it looks with all this. Hmm. Well, there's this option, guys. <laughs> oh my, it's so much fun to decorate and figure out what you're gonna end up with. I may not end up with this, guys. Let's see, let's kind of move on here and just see what else. So one thing that I like to change out seasonally is my little quilt rack here. And right now, it's just got a lot of really warm fuzzy cozy blankets on it which is great we're gonna enjoy them for a lot more months yet but i kind of like to maybe put this on here because it's a little more spring tone so let's see how that looks Okay, let's move on to the next space. So I'm going to be doing this little um, table here in my front entryway.
like it? What do you think? Hello. All right, let's see what looks good. Okay, so I've got these flowers here that I've had. I think I may say these for the fireplace? I don't know. I mean, they kind of look cute there, but it's just not quite it. I don't know, though. <laughs> because this doesn't quite do it either, so. Hmm. Let me go grab a few more things. little bunny rabbit look in here, huh? All right, let's try it. Let me take this away. Let's see, this bunny is just like facing the wrong way or something. <laughs> oh dear. your one of the worst things ever is to like crowd a space but yet you don't want a space to look too empty so what do you guys think let me know down in the comments below what would you change about this space we have left to put here. Now in the summer, I'll probably have, uh, well I don't know, we'll see. I was going to say I'd probably have my bigger plant over here, but um, I don't know. So we could
Well guys, that's a wrap. It's been a lot of fun. If you see anything that you think that you would change about how I've decorated, let me know in the comments below. It's always fun to get a new perspective. And you know, it's also a reminder that it really doesn't take that much to decorate your home and just make it nice for a new season. I just feel so refreshed to have the snowman gone and just have this nice fresh greenery out. It looks very springtime and um, yeah, I'm loving it. So, and don't forget if you like today's vlog, hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up button and stick around. I'd love to have you join our community. I'm a homeschooling mom of four and my channel is pretty much just about all things home related. So I do homeschool videos and uh, lots of day in the lives, uh, some shopping hauls and cleaning and decorating like you saw today. So anyway, I hope you have a great day and happy almost spring. <laughs>